Meghan Markle celebrates with Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet while Prince Harry remains in UK. Meghan Markle began hosting the Archetypes podcast last year. Meghan Markle had reason to celebrate on Thursday as it was announced that the Duchess of Sussex had won a Gracie Award for her Archetypes podcast, that debuted last year. The Gracie Awards are presented by the Alliance of Women in Media Foundation to celebrate programming that was created by Women for Women. The Royal was named as the best podcast host for her series, which aimed to dissect, explore and subvert the labels that try to hold women back over the course of 12 episodes. Following the news, Meghan said, Thank you to the Alliance for Women in Media Foundation for this prestigious honor. This is a shared success for me and the team behind Archetypes, most of whom are women, and the inspiring guests who joined me each week. Meghan and Harry previously hosted the podcast Archie with Audio and you can listen to a snippet of their first episode in the clip below. Other winners this year include Christina Applegate, who recently shared her belief she would stop attending award shows due to her MS, for her role in Dead to Me. Amanda Seyfried will also pick up an award for her role in The Dropout while Faith Hill's role in 1883 also earned her an award. Winners will be commemorated at a gala, which is scheduled for May 23, and will be hosted at the Beverly Wilshire in Los Angeles. A separate luncheon will be held for local and student winners at the Cipriani in New York City on June 20. The theme for this year's Gracie Awards was storytelling and aimed to celebrate the narratives shared by the winners, which not only inform, inspire, and captivate audiences, but also enrich our collective comprehension of the world. Meghan's award comes as her husband, Prince Harry, remains in the United Kingdom where he is in the midst of a legal battle against the publishers of the Daily Mail, ANL. The Duke is one of a number of high-profile individuals bringing privacy claims against ANL over allegations it carried out or commissioned illegal or unlawful information gathering. Harry has joined forces with the likes of Sir Elton John and David Furnish, Baroness Doreen Lawrence of Clarendon and Elizabeth Hurley to bring privacy claims against the publisher over allegations it carried out or commissioned illegal or unlawful information gathering. This included the hiring of private investigators to place listening devices inside cars, the blagging of private records and the accessing and recording of private phone conversations. Harry is believed to have stayed at Frogmore Cottage in Windsor this week. It will be one of the final times he stays at his former UK residence after receiving an eviction notice. But when my love takes me higher, I bring me fire, and I got everything that I need for me right here. Take me high.